Stormont, Belfast, July 19, New Zealand showed their fighting qualities, rallying from the loss of four early wickets to put up a competitive 173-8 in the opening T20 international here and then dismiss hosts Ireland for 142 runs for a comprehensive 31-run victory. With the bat Glenn Phillips scored a quick-fire unbeaten 69 of 52 balls to bring the Black Caps back into the game after they had lost top-order batters Martin Guptal, 24, Finn Allen, 1, Dane Cleaver, 5, and Daryl Mitchell, 5, cheaply. Phillips half-century aided by a 4 for from pace bowler Lockie Ferguson helped the tourists take the lead in the three-match T20i series following their OD series sweep recently. Ireland had a dream start, with opener Finn Allen hitting Josh Little straight to cover, and then dismissing the informed Guptal, who scored a century on the final OD, who holed out to long off off Mark Adair. Dane Cleaver then edged a pull shot off Little to wicketkeeper Tucker. Ireland struck again as Darrell Mitchell top-edged Curtis Camphers delivery to the keeper, but Phillips took the tourists to safety with his half-century. From 54 quarters, the Kiwis recovered to post 173 eighths, with Phillips knock the key contribution, and James Neesham and Michael Bracewell also playing a pair of important hands. In reply, Ireland could never get a productive partnership, though several batters made promising starts. Captain Andy Balbierni was the first to go, slashing Jacob Duffy twice over point for four before falling to a superb catch from Santner, the Black Caps skipper running back from mid-off to cling on as the ball descended sharply. Brief scores. New Zealand 173 eighths in 20 overs, G. Phillips 69 not out, J. Nisham 29 not out, J. Little 4 to 35, beat Ireland 142 in 18.2 overs, C. Camphor 29, M. Adair 25, L. Ferguson 4 14 by 31 runs. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.